Join Wondery Plus to listen to Business Wars one week early and ad-free in the Wondery app. Download the Wondery app in your Apple or Google Play mobile app store today. A note to listeners, this episode contains adult language. It's the summer of 1942. Temperatures push past 100 degrees under the searing Nevada afternoon sun as a dusty Cadillac sputters down Fremont Street, the main drag in a sleepy western town called Las Vegas. The new caddy left Los Angeles a sleek and gleaming machine, but as it heads east for six hours on Highway 91, it takes a brutal beating, overheating repeatedly. Huh. The car pulls over, and two men step out, squinting into the blinding sun. Jesus Christ, Ben, some oasis you picked. The town's a hellhole, Maya. Maybe so, but remember, you can do something here you can't do anywhere else in the country. Uh, kill guys and bury them in the desert? No. Talking about gambling here, legal gambling. Mobster is Meyer Lansky and Benjamin Bugsy Siegel have fringe criminal business ties to Vegas. They're on a scouting mission to expand their holdings. I'm telling you, Ben, this place is an investment opportunity. Sure, it ain't much now, but the local government's easy to work with. And they like making money. Lansky is the head of the Jewish mob and a brilliant financier who runs his underworld business like a corporation. He's made a fortune from narcotics, bootlegging, and casinos, with setups in Cuba, Florida, and New Orleans. Now, he's focused on Vegas. Competition is slim. El Rancho Vegas is pretty much the only game in town. It's nothing special, a year-old cinder block structure with only 63 rooms. Lansky wants Siegel to develop a major resort as a national gambling mecca but he prefers staying out of the spotlight. Siegel, not so much. He's movie star handsome, dapper, and a notorious hitman with well over a dozen kills on his resume. Siegel's been running the lucrative horse racing betting operation for Lansky. That job requires traveling back and forth between LA and Vegas. But the more he makes the loop, the less he likes the desert. Siegel prefers the glitz and...